hey what's going on guys welcome back to another video in this video we're going to be doing question number 14 troubleshooting so the question says after a cluster migration the control plane cube api server is not coming up and before migration edge cd was external and in high availability after migration cube api server was pointing to edge cd peer port 2380 instead of 2379 so if we do k get nodes you can see that it says that the connection was refused if we do k get bots says the same thing and it asks if we specify the right port we can actually see um the status of the cube api server by doing um CTL. uh wait let me do CTL. pay s and then we're gonna use the command grab to grab the cube api server we can also do um k get pods in the cube system but in the cube system in space but um since it doesn't work the k get pods we can do that so if we do CTL ps grab cube api server doesn't come up nothing um but if we actually try again the same command as you can see it says use cube api server control plane one second ago name of the container just basic information but not the information that we actually need right now let me try to copy the container name to see the logs so the command is cctl logs and let me try with this one so just copy and paste it right here let me see what we can get so error code not found description an error code when trying to find container okay so it says container not found let me clear the screen and we can actually change the directory to the var log so here we have we can see the logs of all this information as you can see we have containers here we got syslog we got authorization log apt we got calico cloud in it and here we got pods so let's change directory to pods if we do the command ls we can actually see um all the files that this directory contains there's a lot of them but here's the cube api server is what we need so let's see if this is a file or a directory and as you can see it says it's a directory so let's change directory to this one to the cube api server okay so we're in let me see what we have ls it says cube api server let me see if this is a file too if we do cat cube api server it says it's a directory so let's change directory again so we inside var log pods cube api server and we have two files is 4.log and 5.log we can see that it says fail to connect address 127.0012380 so the default for this the the default port is 2379 that's gonna be always that number so let me change directory to the manifest file and as you can see we have the cube api server so let's use the vi editor we're gonna scroll a little bit down in the part where it says etcd servers https so we're gonna change this to 79 and that's it let's save this it's gonna save automatically so let me clear the screen and now if we do k get pot or no, no it's not gonna work you have to wait a few seconds and as you can see we have it right here everything is working perfectly fine so if an exam doesn't work you gotta give it a few minutes maybe just go to the next question and and try to resolve the next question then come back and let me do CTOPS grab cube api server and as you can see it's in a state running 
so that means that everything is working perfectly fine guys and this is gonna be it for this video i hope you like it and i'm gonna see you in the next one